Hey guys, what's up? This is Agatardi2744 here today to do a tutorial on how to jailbreak iOS 4.3.3 as well as even the iPad 2 now. This is the very first iPad 2 jailbreak and it is such an easy, safe way to jailbreak. So without further ado, I'm going to be showing you guys how to jailbreak with jailbreakme.com. So I first want to go ahead and tell you guys that I am running 4.3.3. Yes, you do have to be running 4.3.3 in order to do this jailbreak at the meantime. They're talking about an update making it available for all versions in the future though. But for now, it's just 4.3.3. So you have to make sure you're on 4.3.3. Here all you do is go to jailbreakme.com and this is so easy, it's probably the easiest way to jailbreak. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys around the site here, it's just a simple design. You have the free button inspired by the app store slash iTunes. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and go into more information and tell you guys a little bit about it. And I want to focus specifically on the can jailbreaking brick my device. And the coolest thing of all is with jailbreakme you can completely reverse it and it does not break your device as no chance of breaking your device which makes it pretty much safe that's what made me want to jailbreak my ipad too so and also if you enjoyed this jailbreak go ahead and donate to the developers they really need your support here clicking free and install that's all you have to do and immediately Cydia will start loading on your ipad too this is making it one of the easiest ways to jailbreak, and it appears as though my Cydia is loading a lot slower than other people's have been loading in the past. But uh, first things first, like I said, this is completely reversible. So if something goes wrong, you can go ahead and plug it in iTunes and reboot it to original factory settings. This is a $500 device. I was debating on whether or not to jailbreak it because I didn't want to break it. But I realized after reading the more information that this cannot be bricked and if something goes wrong I can reverse it. Now does that mean you're going to get your warranty back and stuff? No, that's already cancelled once you jailbreak it unfortunately. But here it is now once this is finished installing as you guys can see right there. My device is now officially jailbroken. This does work on iPhone, iPod Touch as well as the iPad 4.3.3. I'm going to go ahead and select that I am a user and Cydia will go ahead and open proving to you guys that this iPad 2 is currently jailbroken. That was super easy. You could probably do this in less than a minute. Uh, my Cydia downloading was a little bit slow on the other hand. Thank you for watching this Zagatardi 2744. Please be sure to go ahead and subscribe for more of our iOS devices. I'm making about daily videos now right on this channel, Zagatardi 2744. Please also feel free to go ahead and visit in the description below. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter for extra news, as well as check out my new website, iosnova.com, for daily iPhone, iPod Touch, as well as iPad news, as well as for your iOS 5 betas and all jailbreak firmwares. Thank you for watching once again. Please also feel free to go ahead and leave your comments and thumbs up. If you guys enjoyed this video, I'll be replying to the comments within the first week of this video upload. Thank you for watching. This is Agatardi2744.